the, probably my best price would be eight for eighty. No. 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 I can sell them. I can sell them. You can for ten, no. ten dollars each is a bulk deal. Yeah. No. 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 I can get the money for them. Yeah. 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 No, that's okay. So a hundred would be your bet. Ninety. Yeah. No, ninety-five will be my best. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're doing the, the Sunday markets today, the flea market run. I'm at the Carrara markets, nice and early here on the Gold Coast. So coffee in hand, I'm good to go. About to tick over to 7 a.m. and uh, we're gonna dive in and see what we can find. Hey, let me know in the comments below today during this video, what I miss, what, what items I should have bought or, or at least had a bit of a discussion about purchasing. Uh, no doubt there'll be a few items in this video that I do leave behind, I'm no expert. Um, but yeah, look, I'm a full-time reseller on eBay for anybody out there that's new to the channel. Welcome. Uh, consider subscribing. Everyone else, hit the like button for me. You know how much that helps the channel. Let's dive in. We'll see what we can find. Hello, sir. How are you? I'm really well, you? Yeah, very good, thanks. That's yeah, all right. Very, very How's it been this morning? Just patchy. So patchy? Yeah, just a bit patchy. I hear you. It's yeah, that's yeah. it. Yeah, nice. Have you been doing this most weeks? Yeah, do I do it much? Yeah. Yeah, I do this one and I do Heron Trail, Dog Fish Fishing, Gary Fishing, and yeah. Nice. Yeah. All right, good stuff. How much on the games bundle? Uh, Three dollars. Three dollars for that? Yep. All right, mate. I'll take that. Hey, right, mate. Is the NSPS3? Yeah. How much are these? Uh, $10 each or $2 for $15. Okay. Okay. $10. How's it been this morning? Been alright. Been alright? Yeah. <laughs> are these all your collections, are they? Yeah. Yeah, right. Um, what would you do for four? For four games? Um, four of them. I'll do 25. 25 for four? How about 20? I'll take those. Yeah, yeah. Happy with that? Yeah. All right. Ten bucks. Ten bucks? Ten bucks, mate. Right? In the front seat. I'll put it under the food. Who is it? Who have we got? Uh, Daryl. Daryl Green. Yeah, oh, shit. I couldn't tell you if there's a knock off or if it's real, mate. I could not tell you. It's got all the badges on it, so. Where'd you get him? Uh, we, we go for units and auctions and stuff like that. So we acquire a lot of our gear out of abandoned auctions. Oh, okay. Deceased estates and stuff. Deceased estates, yeah. So a lot of our stuff is old and antique -y and sort of stuff, which is good. Yeah, this is a pretty, I mean, Redskins as well. That's a pretty cool jersey. 10 bucks. Have you got any other jerseys? Just what's here, just the Broncos, the boys, they're not a, what the, uh, anything sort of sporty I, I put to the side, the rest of them just get chucked in a car. Yeah. Most of them are just soccer, you got the Brisbane Broncos hoodie. Brisbane Broncos hoodie, yeah. Uh, what's that Brisbane Bronco hood? Oh, yeah. Tranny jersey. Yeah, that's cool. And then, yeah, just the same old Brisbane Bronco. And, um, Bronco shirts. Bronco gears. Yeah, here last week I sold State of Origin. Oh man, probably a thousand dollars worth of gear for two hundred bucks. Shut up. Yeah, that's cool. 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 Yeah, I'm just looking at the quality of that one. Oh, mate, she's, she's not one you're gonna. Would you do two for 15? 
do for Dan Dandil. Dandil? Dandil. Oh, mate, I'll do that. Thank you. Mate, can I have a little for them as well? Through those? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, mate, they're all yours. You've done pretty well there, hey? Are you after the horror DVDs? Oh, more horror ones, yeah. Me too, me too. They're hard to find at the moment. Oh, no, they are. Even the older ones, mate. I actually look for the same thing, and then I saw your stash. Yeah. You've done really well. And I got seven DVDs. Seven? Yeah. Okay. Two dollars. Two dollars? Yeah. Thank you, sir. Cheers. Appreciate it. What about actually what about the shoes? Would you do ten on those? Um later in the day I would. Later probably. in the day? Yeah, it is. All right. Huntington Beach in California. Huntington yeah. Beach. Yeah. I've actually been there myself. Yeah, they've got that um, quick silver store just on the corner there. Yeah. The big shop just across from the, the pier. That's where you got them from. Because I think these are late. Are they Lakers? Uh, yeah, I think so. Lakers. Um... Yeah, right. Yeah. Oh, I'll take yeah, them off 15. Last year and this year we haven't been able to go. Well, how much is it suck not being able to travel, hey? It's terrible. My husband imports American muscle cars. So oh, really? That's what he does. Yeah. He still does it online now, but because he's got an office in Long Beach, so he's business partner. Oh, yeah. He looks out for cars for him. Yeah, right. Uh, we normally go every year. He goes shopping. I mean, he goes car searching, and we go shopping for cars. Yeah. And then we go to Disneyland and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah. yeah. No, oh, unreal. It's one of my favourite parts of the world, the yeah. Cali Coast. Yeah. Good stuff, guys. Thank yeah, you very much. Thank you. Thank you. How much on that? Dollar on the hat, I'll grab that one. <laughs> Thank you guys, appreciate it. You have a good one. How much on the uh, the jeans? Levi's ten dollars. All the rest are five. All the rest are five. Yeah. And the DVDs? Uh, dollar each for fifteen for ten dollars. Fifteen for ten. Okay. Well, I've got um 
I've got seven DVDs here. I had a bit of a look through. Five bucks worth. Would you do 20 if I took the two pairs of jeans as well? Two Levi's for, um, right. and, and that all together for 20. I got seven DVDs, I was just after the Levi's. Yeah, right, that's right. 20 bucks? Yeah. Okay, no worries. Hi guys. Hello. How are you? Good. How much have you got on the shoes? All different. Sizes. All different. Yeah. Okay. Those ones are ten. Ten for these. Yep. Ten for them. Ten for those. Size are they? Six and a half. Twenty. Twenty on the caramel. Is that right? That's not a brand I've actually heard of. Oh, are they? And they're new. Yeah, okay. The Nikes. Twelve on the Nikes. And what about the vans? Vans 10. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm definitely interested in a few. What, how much for these ones? Those ones are 15. 15 on those. Put them there. Um, all right, okay, all right, okay. You said 12 for those? Uh, so what do we got? One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I definitely want 20 for them. Yep. So 20, 30, 40, 50, um, 30, 50. These ones had a bit of wear I noticed on the bottom, so I'm not sure about these ones. Fifteen and ten. Yeah. Yeah. So I've got to have fifty there. Sixty-five. I want fifteen for them as well. Sixty-five, seventy, eighty, ninety, hundred. Hundred. How many have we got all up in total? So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight for a hundred. Yep. Um, the, probably my best price would be eight for eighty. No, no, no. no. I can sell them. I can sell them. You can for ten yeah. ten dollars each is a bulk deal. Yeah. No. 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 I can get the money for them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, that's okay. So a hundred would be your best. Ninety. Yeah. No, ninety-five will be my best. Ninety-five. Because I'll drop them down to the ten. So what does that work out to per shoe? Ninety-five. That'd be about. Yeah. $2.50 each. Because I dropped them for 15 as well. I wanted 15 for them. And 15 for them. And I've dropped the two off the others. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so 
I'll, I'm happy to happy to buy bulk. Happy to buy a number of them off here. Um, ninety-five. Could you do ninety? I'd definitely take them for ninety. Take 90? Okay. Great. How are we guys? Yeah, not too bad. Tell you what, your advertising got me. <laughs> Never been more than Merrill's. They're women's, they're not men's. They're women's, are they? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm that's a shame. I was, you know, I was going to go hiking and stuff because I was really cheap. Yeah. Really worn them. Oh. They're pretty heavy, though. Yeah. It's a shame they're not men's. No, sorry. <laughs> I wasn't going to buy men's shoes. No, of course not. Of course not. <laughs> this is pretty cool, too, hey? It's all right. He's from New York. He's from New York? Yeah. Unreal. How's it been this morning? Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. It's all about location, isn't just it? Just downsizing, so I just just clearing out the house. Clearing out. Yeah, love it. No, very good. Well, hopefully, there's a few more that roll through for you. <laughs> no dramas. Yeah, I just saw the, on the tongue in there. I think they're a US, US 9, 9, I believe. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Were they your sons, were they? Yeah, it's got huge feet. Yeah, it certainly <laughs> does. Keeps growing. Yeah. It goes through a new hair every year. <laughs> What's this set here? They're, they're really old-fashioned. I grew up with them. They've got a, um, they're all small stories. Yeah. So every night of the week. Oh, every night of the week. That's yeah. really cool. Yeah, so wow. Just tiny little stories that you read to your kids. Perfect for when you don't want to read a long one. Yeah, yeah that's right. The short story. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're yeah, they're quite cool. Cute. They're quite old too. From oh, they're the looks very old. Like. Yeah. Yeah, okay. And then you got the Minecraft there as well. Yeah. Yeah, kids growing up, going out of stuff. Mm. Well, I um, took the two book sets yep. and the shoes. Would you do 20? I'd do 25 for all three. 25 for all three. Um, would you do five just for the shoes? Uh, no, probably not. No? I might try That's the right. marketplace in quite good condition. Yep, no worries. Might go the, I'll go the football boots for 10 then. Football. Okay, no yep. worries. No worries. You know, it's the mystery. Hello, sir. Mm -hmm. How are you? Good. That's all right. How's it been today? Yeah, not too bad. Yeah. Good few new ones in there today, but oh, mate, you do. Out of the uh, collection at home, and a lot of them went pretty quick. Bon Jovi. You had a kiss one in here, didn't you? Yeah, it's still there somewhere. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, incredible. Do you find it hard to part with them? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, but I still got, I still got a lot of them at home still. Do you? I what's your, going. what's your favourite that you got? Oh, I don't know if I have any favourites. I just, I've always had, always bought records, you know, from when I was really young, and they're all original old. They are, yeah. yeah. There's no, uh, they're incredible. I haven't got any new stuff. No, but the old stuff's the best stuff. Yeah. Yeah, there's one over here. There's only one there. There's that one here. How much on the CDs? Well, 
Some of them are good, you know, the gooder ones are five and then four and three. They had a real good uh, concert there on here a bit earlier, but it went pretty fast. Oh, yeah, I bet it did. Yeah, I bet it did. Oh, Jam. How much on the Ramones t shirt? $5. I'll take that one. And would you do would you do ten for these three? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Then you got the t-shirt. So. All right, guys. I am back at home now. It's been a very very successful day at the markets. I'll just do a quick fly through here. The first thing that we found today were these video games. Now it was the soccer games for three dollars. I'm actually just going to bundle them with an Xbox console because they don't sell well individually. I knew that before I bought it, but for just $3, I couldn't help myself. I had to get it. I tried to go on my prior knowledge with these games. Unfortunately, Sonic Generations is the only good one there, a $20 game. These three didn't comp out as heavy as I thought they would. Forza uh, Horizon can go for $40, so that's why I bought those two, hoping that one of them would be sort of a $20 plus game. Unfortunately not. Out of these DVDs in that big bin rack that you would have seen earlier on, um, I just went for the horror DVDs, but I believe that guy beat me to it, and he did pinch all the good ones. Uh, all of these that you can see here, except for the ring and rings, uh, they all go for about $10 to $15 each. So there's still going to be some really good money made. Remember, I only paid $2 for that stack. This was a, a much better stack. Um, this game, uh, sorry, uh, DVD right here, Return of the Living Dead Part 2. I've sold that one for $30 previously, so I know that's a $30 game. Uh, that was a huge get. And there's some really good ones in here as well, sort of again around that uh, 10 to 15 Even Judge Dredd can go for $20, so that was a good one. Uh, the Levi Strauss, I got these for $7.50 in the end. They should both sell for about 40 bucks. The hat, the NHL hat, I just love finding these sort of vintage looking um, US sport type hats. So to be able to find that, I thought was pretty fantastic. Uh, this one wasn't in the video, but um, J Brand, I picked this up for $5. Comes on eBay anywhere between sort of 30 to 40. So I grabbed that. Uh, Ramones t-shirt, won't do a massive amount of money on that, but I still thought I'd pick it up for $5. Um, now, Dyer of a Flipper, he always tells me to have a look for the toys. So I found this guy. Um, he's got a 2005 um, WWE on the shoe, so we'll see how we go with that one. Very excited about this. In the uh, in the in the flea, uh, this my phone actually died, so I couldn't negotiate. I actually ended up sorry, I couldn't negotiate on camera. Um, I ended up getting this one for ten dollars instead of fifteen. So a Mitchell and Ness branded Lakers jumper, extra large, that'll sell very very fast. Uh, you got a fifteen dollar Michael Jackson CD there. I reckon I'll be able to get about fifteen for each of these, so maybe forty five dollars. And then this one as well, the Washington Redskins, no longer a team in the NFL, so that could have a little bit of money worth on it. I don't exactly know just yet, but it was Mitchell and Ness branded. It needs a bit of a clean, but a very very cool find, especially being the Washington Redskins. And then this one as well, the Brisbane Broncos jersey. I thought this was a great grab, a 95 vintage, uh, genuine uh, Brisbane Broncos jersey. And I think it's a size 2XL. So I ended up getting that one and that one for $7.50, which is an absolute steal. And then the best of the day was all of these shoes that I'm yet to look out. But um, yeah, what did I spend? Like $90 all up. I spent $15 on these as well. So 105 bucks for about 10 pairs of shoes today. Uh, so that was that. They were all actually excellent shoes, and they're all going to sell really well. So, uh, all in all, one hundred and ninety-eight dollars spent. It's um, it's been a super day. I really have come to notice over the last few months that I've definitely, I've definitely got a little bit better in the sense of being able to pick out the good items. So I remember going to these flea markets a few months ago, and I was horrendous. Couldn't pick out an item of any value because I just didn't have that knowledge. So for you guys that might be beginning, I think these videos are actually really important for you guys just to tune into to see what value uh, is in certain products. Um, you know, I think if you can continue to do it, go out and source, do your comp searching, get familiar with certain products, simply over time, you just get better at learning of what to get, what not to get. Now, I'm not certainly saying that what I've done today is the best of the bunch that was out there. No doubt I've left hundreds of dollars on the table by not picking certain items. Do let me know in the comments below if there were any in the video that you saw that I should have picked up because I'm always learning and I'm just trying to pass on my experience 
but I have definitely noticed over the last few months that I have improved um, with my picking ability. So uh, a really great grab today, $198, um, gonna be well over $1,000 worth of resale value. So um, a very successful day, hopefully a fun video for you guys to have tuned into as well. Uh, remember to like the video, I'll leave you with my old school uh, flea market video from a few months ago right here to tune into, and you'll be able to see the difference on what I was buying back then to what I'm being able to buy now. Thanks for tuning in, guys. We'll see you soon.